everyone. So I'm gonna make this pretty quick. Hopefully you can hear me. But we are at 5th and D right now. This is uh, where the three car crash happened right before shots were fired. I'm gonna flip over the camera so you can kind of see where we are right now. And see that, that Jetta right there with the driver's side just smashed up. And you can see another car right there with the... This, and then you can see kind of the cars right there too. So this, this was an officer involved shooting and you can see this the road behind me right there it just blocked off since we got here I think when we got here probably about half an hour ago maybe even longer as we're going into Davis off 80 you can start hearing all the sirens we're passing by another vehicle I think it was a sheriff's office vehicle you can hear the canines just barking and just sirens just been going off all around this area uh, for those just kind of tuning in let me flip the camera so you could just see there there's a that was involved right there. Just to, to give some information, this is um, gonna be very brief because this is what we know so far. I'm gonna cross the street right now. Um, but we're on 5th and D, and this is where um, a three car crash happened. A female police officer with the city of Davis responded and then shots were fired. And we're at the location where the manhunt is going on right now. Um, it is on 5th and D, just to repeat myself. Let me just show people who are just tuning in here. So as far as we know, we do know that the manhunt, this is where the manhunt is going on. Fifth and D, I'm just pulling up my notes here. Um, the female officer um, was the one who was struck and she is in serious condition and she is at the UC Davis Medical Center right now. Um, and it started with a three vehicle crash. You can see the Jetta right there and let me just turn the camera here. It's all banged up there and then you see another car right there, but this is where it's all roped off. There's a lot of questions I'm gonna answer, um, try to answer as many, as much as I can. As someone is asking where this is. I am on 5th and D right now, and this is where the, uh, the crash happened, where the police officer responded. We're seeing fire trucks just kind of right behind me, blocking off parts of the road. As we're going into Davis, you can see a lot of the police, uh, police officers blocking certain parts of the streets as we're coming in. Um, there is a shelter in place, but we're seeing some people, there's someone behind me kind of just walking around 
I did talk to someone. He was pulling up the caution tape for officers. You can hear sirens just right there, right next to me on the, the block next to me. So we're just right at 5th and D right now. But we've been hearing a lot of that for the past half hour or so. And Nicole information, I can only give you as much information as police are giving us. They said this is really early on. It's a very active scene um, and they're still really working on it right now. So UC Davis just put this out um, on Twitter and they're asking people if you witness the shooting or have information, please dial 911 um, and only call 911 if you are in emergency. They ask people to stay inside because there is a shelter in place here in Davis. I'm going through the comments too and some people are asking about the female police officer um, it is a female police officer she is being treated at UC Davis Medical Center um, and she uh, is in serious condition at, uh, right now So I'm gonna wrap this up um, in a little bit because we're gonna move our car. Um, but people are asking which direction he was headed last. Um, we didn't get that information from police. All they could tell us, um, and let me kind of move to a safer side here. Um, but they said a female police officer was responding to a three car crash. And you could see one of the cars right there on 5th and D where she, and right after the crash, a crash she was shot and she was taken to UC Davis Medical Center. Um, she is in serious condition, um, and that's at, at this point all the information that we have. We do know that there is an active manhunt going on right now on in this area where we're at right now, um, and that's information that we have so far from police since it is such an active scene.